G'day, I'm from the Australian Government. You know, the wankers who killed the Great Barrier Reef. The largest living structure on the planet, visible even from outer space. Whoops. But don't worry, there's another great wonder down under. So say goodbye to the Great Barrier Reef and say hello to the Great Australian Bight. One of the few remaining places we haven't completely rooted, the Bight is a pristine sanctuary for shitloads of endangered species. Dolphins, whales and whatever these freaks are. It's also the heart of our fishing industry, which makes it the perfect next choice of greatness to annihilate under our Malka policy. Make Australia less great again. That's why we're about to let a bunch of eco-criminals drill for oil in the bight. Yup, right in the middle of those sanctuaries. Is it a good deal? Sure, for these c**ts who walk away with billions in profits while paying bugger all taxes, which means the economic benefit for you is approximately zero. Will it create jobs? Stacks? In the booming post-apocalyptic dead planet tourism industry which we're helping to bring about. Is it safe? Of course. Of course not. Remember that time that oil rig blew up, causing the biggest ecological fail ever? That was in calm waters and close to rescue services. And this is the bite. An ocean so pissed off and remote, our chances of containing a spill here are approximately fuck all. Which is why even oil companies have forecast that if, I mean when a spill occurs, it will pretty much endanger the entire southern coast of Australia, along with all the fishing and tourism jobs. Are we going to do it anyway? You betcha. Our mates are just waiting for the great Green light from Nopsema, our super dodgy regulator which we've stacked full of former oil executives. Which is why, unless you get wind of this bullshit and tell us to get foe, drilling should commence as early as 2018. Welcome to the Great Australian Bite, home to our next great fuck up. Authorised by the Department for Making Australia Less Great Again.